house lawn and worship you. I hope that we never take that for granted, Lord. I hope that we can always remember that you have given us this freedom and that much of it begins with a good educational system. Father, I begin by praying for our education of the Word of God. We often think about education in the, in the uh, structured school system. It all begins with our hearts and our mind and meditating on your Word. May we be educated in your Word. May our pastors, our churches, our teachers bring forth the truth so that the Word can be planted deep within our hearts to transform our lives. I pray for our structural structure of our educational system and, and uh, many changes that are happening from the state level all the way down to our local schools. Lord, we believe in your sovereignty and we believe that you're in charge. God, you ordain things that happen through our government and we are so blessed to have representatives in this area with Carlin Yoder and Wes Culver and other people that have been involved in the educational reform system that we believe you move through people to make things happen. Sometimes it's painful, sometimes we don't agree, but we know that you're in charge. We call down your power upon our educators and may they be safe as crime and violence continues to increase and the enemy prowls around the earth, roaming from place to place, trying to seek and destroy our country by attacking our children's minds. Our children are your future leaders. They will be in this prayer meeting someday leading our government and leading our city. Father, in the name of Jesus, may their minds be protected in our educational system. May they receive the truth and may they receive a good education that will equip them to have the skills in their life that they can lead this city in the future. May they receive the truth. May they May they understand and discern the difference between the truth and a lie. God, protect our teachers as they go forth every day under the attack of the enemy. If the enemy can break down our educational system, the enemy can break down our country. If we become an uneducated Lord, we know that we're in serious trouble. We also know, Father, that it takes a good skilled education and a heart crying out for God to be a successful nation. Help us to understand, Lord, that it not only begins with the elementary level and preschool level, it works us all the way up to the high school levels. We pray for our high schools and our all of our schools in this community that they can use discernment. We pray for our superintendents who are making big decisions at this point. Lord, may your anointing be upon their lives as they gather together with their administrative cabinets. May they make decisions that are good for our children and fair for our children. May we remember, Lord, that you are the foundation of our educational system, and we can't do it without you and your anointing. God, as we go forth, may we remember to pray daily for our educators, and may education go forth according to your will. We love you, and we claim your presence over our educational programs in this city Lord, we take back our schools in the name of Jesus. Amen. At this time, please join in small.